Egyptian Tug Foundation is involved in the development of indigenous communities in the Cordillera region. Our vision always is self-reliant and self-sustaining communities. Shintu believes in the people there can build their own development given their own culture and their own resources. During our childhood times, uh, we can raise many varieties of crops, but now that there is a climate change, we have to adjust our planting season. We have to look for varieties that is adaptable to the soil because uh, even the pH of the soil have changed. <laughs> this summer time, we cannot have our garden. As you can see, our rice fields, many have not been planted because lack of water. Uh, rain is not uh, proportionately come. It's uh, raining there, but here it's not raining. They are expecting already to earn income and sell something in the market only to find out that these crops are all damaged. So that made me think of trying to be more relevant by shifting into you know, a new project known as climate change. First, we gave the idea of putting a learning farm where we introduce the climate resilient crops. It is there where we bring our farmers to learn what is climate resilient and what are not climate resilient crops. It is a strategy of learning by doing. I have to the natural way. At least I have to say I have to say I and then we encourage them to, you know, when they go back to their farms, they have to practice what they learned in that learning farm. Matiak magiting ako. Win mabal nga apply damot lang dagijay masur suru damot lang dito idea makita dahon dagijay dado mga makikita danga araram idem ng kasla dagiti panagkumpos panag. Rain shelter, Since you observe that it is only the men who might have been holding the power, we, we want to have what we call the voice of everybody. With the empowerment that uh, we had introduced by developing also their confidence and their capabilities, we were able to somehow, little by little, introduce women into this uh, activities that are crucial in their socioeconomic life. There are more women now who participate in community activities, in municipal activities, and even during seminars and trainings. The unique uh, system of the Shontog Foundation comparing to others is that their heart is uh, looking into what are the re real uh, life on that area, and uh, they sustain their program. So the foundation give us a report, so we include that on our municipal development program here also. If there are some problems that they cannot do it alone, they will ask our help. It shows that they are very serious on the matter. A community that adapts. A community that is no longer afraid that their crops would be destroyed. A community that has the confidence to you know, keep on planting that is more stable, more self-sufficient, and more self-reliant.